Right, I'm hoping for a better game. Um, it's Oxide, Colonel Panic in the top right, Plain, um, Protoss, Maticus in the bottom left. Colonel Panic in the last game just won and never built anything but Zealots. Literally, literally, only thing he built, Zealots. Let's just build some Zealots. Oh no, I tell a lie, he did build about two Stalkers at one point. Um, and to be honest, I thought it was an utterly disgusting game. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I think it's just a best of five. I think it is. Colonel Panic is one game up. And, um, yeah, disgusted. Literally disgusted by what I saw in that last game. At no time should anybody ever be losing uh, Stalkers to Zealots that don't have charge. You just, you shouldn't be doing that. At no time should four Zealots be killing 17 of your workers. I mean, even if you just attack four Zealots with 17 workers, the workers will kill the Zealots and some of them will still be alive. I'm pretty sure if you just A click 17 workers against four zealots, the 17 workers wins. And that's without the backup of four stalkers. Come on. Literally despicable. Anyway, this is a new game, and I'm going to withhold judgment. Um, so Maticus comes in to have a look and isn't going to see anything out of the ordinary. So even though uh, this pylon is up, it's actually early. Um, so, you know, normally that's something you look for. You go in and you see, oh, look, there isn't a second pylon in the base. The, the second pylon must be somewhere. Um, but it's actually a little early. So if you were going in, uh, if you were going in about now, you, you know, when you're yourself playing Protoss, it's much easier to figure this out because when you need to build a pylon, that's when your opponent needs to build a pylon. So when you look around their base, if you don't see that second pylon, you know it's somewhere on the map. Um, now, interested to see if Maticus will scout this. He has scouted across the map, but you know, didn't really see anything bizarre. Um, there's a side core coming in for Colonel Panic. I don't know why he bothers. He only ever builds zealots. Um, Maticus with the expo, his his workers in the middle of the map here. I'd love to see it go back in because if it gets to here and sees that there's no nexus, you know straight away, hey man, where's your nexus? You are up to no good. Um, now there's nothing, nothing building for Maticus right now, and that is really, really concerning. Uh, it looks to me like this is just going to be a really quick GG. There are about to be. Uh, isn't building a zealot at home, and I, you know I wouldn't mind uh, seeing a, a zealot come out from home. Uh, but he's chronoing the zealots here. Um, this one, uh, he just you know, if I'm Colonel Panic, send these straight in. Don't don't wait. Send them in with the worker, um, as well, and and just get into your opponent's base. Uh, there's going to be a stalker coming out, and you know with the right micro. This one stalker will will beat these three zealots if you pull the workers as well. Using the workers to surround your stalker to body block. It'll really mess with the AI from the zealots. They'll be trying to attack the stalker because it's the thing attacking them. The probes, you, you have them not on attack move. You just have them getting in the way and, and therefore the zealots won't attack them. But the stalker, the, what you definitely don't want to do is get this stalker surrounded. Um, you're running, but look, you need to stop and shoot. Stop and shoot. Shoot, um, shoot, shoot, shoot. And, and he, d he just needs to pull the workers. And the other thing he needs to do is continue building workers. That is overwhelmingly the most important thing you need to get going on here. He could also, it would do no harm to drop a cannon um, since you've got the forge. Um, another stalker is going to come out here. I don't like the rally because it's going to move towards these zealots and this could be bad. Needs to rally it over here. Uh, oh, uh, mm, uh, ooh, what? Uh, shield batteries at this stage, you know, why didn't the shield batteries come down the moment you saw those zealots arrive? Well, like that was the time for it and now the cannon comes down, but it's too late. Your, your base is full of zealots. Look at all these zealots hacking away at stuff. But Colonel Panic here, if he drops a pylon here and a gateway here, he, he could actually trap these zealots and they'd have to cut their way out through buildings and that'd be pretty sweet. Um, I, I, yeah, production wise, uh, needs to continue building these workers, needs to get them coming out, and needs to repower uh, the gateway. Um, I'd love to see some chrono come down on this immortal. 
Uh, if he gets the Immortal out in range of these two shield batteries, the Immortal will just kill everything uh, because he can drop the uh, overcharge or whatever it's called. Uh, but the pylon gets focused on, I, I, you know, I think it's just GG. It, it, like, to be fair to Maticus, um, if you haven't scouted the proxy, uh, it was always going to be a tough hold, but it could have been a hold. But, you know, mistakes were made. There is no two ways about that. So this is definitely a GG. Um, Colonel Panic still warping stuff in. There isn't really any point. You know, it's 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 over. Uh, yeah, mistakes were definitely made here, Maticus. Um, so, you know, let's think this through. You see the Zealots appear. If you've got a forge, literally the first thing you do is you slap down the cannon and get it building straight away. Even if it doesn't finish, it soaks up fire from those zealots. The zealots have to focus it. Um, get the shield batteries down the moment you see that appear. Uh, drop an extra pile on if you've got the money to do it because you know if you're the person with the zealots, one of the things you can do obviously is kill the pylons and depower your opponent's structures so they can't build anything. Next move, with your zealot, pull enough workers, sorry, with your stalker, pull enough workers to surround the stalker. So right click those workers onto the stalker. Um, and what you can do then is once you've got a nice surround on the stalker, you can put, you can hit tap itch and hold those probes in position so that the zealots have to cut through the probes to get to the stalker. Um, they won't do that by themselves. They won't automatically do that. They'll just kind of dance about. So that requires micro on the part of your opponent. Meanwhile, your stalker is shooting away, freeing up your time. Uh, the other thing you've got to got to do is continue to build those workers. Keep them coming out because you're going to lose some workers. So make sure you don't take your finger off production. Keep on building the workers. Keep Chrono in the gateway, getting another unit out, etc. Those are the key types of things. Anyway, Colonel Panic goes to.